My Lab, Excel Courses, Uploading Files to Your Course, January 2017. If you are using MathXL or MathXL for School, you can upload documents from your Course Manager screen. Click Upload Course Documents, and you can select which course to upload materials for. You can create folders to organize information and upload documents or media. You can choose whether students will have access to these files. After you upload a course file, your students can access it from the My Course Documents link on the course homepage. In most MyLab Excel-based products, you will upload documents using the Document Sharing option from the link on your menu, typically located under Course Tools. In Foundation-style courses, it is under Student Tools. What if you wanted to have a PDF as an item on your menu? You can associate a PDF, HTML, image, video, or other media file with a menu item and add it anywhere in your course menu. When you select the file's menu item, its contents will appear in the content pane. Let's take a look at uploading a PDF. Select Manage Course from the main menu. The Edit Course menu page opens. To begin adding an item, select Add New Menu Item at the top of the page. Enter the item name you want to appear in the course menu and choose Content Upload, PDF, HTML, or Media. To add a new sub-item within the existing course menu hierarchy, select the Expand icon at the location you want, then select the Add Sub-Item icon, the plus sign. New menu items appear at the bottom of the menu and can easily be clicked and dragged to new positions. After your menu item is created, return to that page and click Manage View, Manage in the top right hand corner. Select Browse to choose your file. Try to keep the files you upload smaller than 10 megabytes and preferably closer to 2. Select Upload File. You can tell that your file successfully uploaded if both fields Current File and File to Link To are set to the file you uploaded. To return to your content page, select Manage View and then View. You can replace the content with an updated version of a file at a later time. Open to the item from the course menu, select Manage View and then Manage, select Browse to choose a new or updated file, select Upload File, and then confirm that you want to overwrite the original file. You can tell that your file successfully uploaded if both fields will be set to the file you uploaded. To return to the content page, select Manage View, then View. What if you wanted to upload a Microsoft Document, PowerPoint, Excel, etc.? Follow the same steps to access the menu and create a new item using the drop-down menu. You can also simply create a content page to post information or create a linked page to a website. Click Manage View, Manage and following the file formatting tips. File size should be smaller than 10 megabytes and preferably closer to 2. Avoid using any special type of characters in the file name and keep the file name short. If your PowerPoint file contains window meta files, WMF files, the images increase the file size by a considerable amount. To avoid this, save your images as JPEG files and insert them in the PowerPoint to reduce the file size. You can click in Product Help to learn more about file formatting. You can also save Word and PowerPoint files as PDF and upload them for alternate presentation form. This may be easier for all students to access. To later replace a document uploaded file, you can upload a new version or a new file to replace the content on the menu item. Again, open the item from the course menu, select Manage View above the content page, then select Manage. Choose the new or updated DOCX, XLSX, or PPTX file. Select Upload and Convert, and to confirm that you want to override the original file, select OK. The message will confirm that your file has been submitted for conversion to web format. Conversion times may vary, select OK. To return to your content page, select Manage View, then View. Thank you for watching our video about adding documents to your MyLab course. Be sure to watch other videos on our playlists.